Hello, welcome, I'm so happy you're here. In this video, I'm gonna talk about three signs for you to look out for to know that your specific person is close, to know that this manifestation of your specific person is close, is near. How do you know you can look out for the, these three signs? Before I jump in, please make sure you're subscribed to my channel in the corner or below. Also know that I offer lots of self-study manifesting courses. There's a whole section on how to manifest your specific person down there. I think there's five courses, maybe six courses in that section now. So I can also help you manifest lots of other things. So you can check all those courses out below. And the last thing I'll say is I do a weekly giveaway for a bundle of three ebooks that I wrote. The way to enter into the contest is to subscribe to my channel, to like this video, and to comment below. So what are three signs that are going to tell you that your specific person is close, that this manifestation of your specific person is close? Well, first of all, I did a video like this quite a few months ago, and I'll link it up there, but I have three different signs in that video, so if you wanna watch it afterwards, I have three totally new signs in this video, and what you're gonna find about my signs, before I jump in and tell you what they are, um, there's a common theme with all of them, and the common theme is they have a lot to do with your inner state. And the reason for this, the reason my signs are not necessarily things on the outside, but they're more inner signs, There's, there are things that are going on inside of you. The reason for this is because, as you know, we are creating our entire realities with our inner world. So your inner world is 100% responsible for what appears outside of you. So the best place to look and see if you're on the right track to manifest or if something is near, it's always going to be to look within and see where your inner state is. And when your inner state is landed in a particular place, which again, I'm going to give you the three specific things you can look out for in this video. But um, when your inner state is landed in the experience of knowing that your specific person is going to come to you, it's just a matter of time. They are going to come to you. So let's jump into the signs. The first sign that I have for this video about the signs to manifest your specific person, how to know that they are near, is you don't feel like anything is missing. This is a big one. And I want to, I want to give details about this because this does not mean that you literally don't notice that your specific person isn't in your life. That's not what I mean. You can, you can still notice that you're not in a relationship. You could be looking at your life and noticing that you're not in a relationship. But what I really mean by this sign is you don't feel lack about it. You're not feeling anxious. You're not feeling freaked out. You're not feeling obsessive. You're not feeling that lack state. That lack state is the inner feeling that they're not here, right? They're not here, and then that evokes often some panic. It just evokes uncomfortable feelings. So a really good sign that your manifestation is close is you're not in that lack state. So you're in more of a confident state. Again, you can still be noticing that they're not present in your outer reality, but you want to have these other two signs that I'm going to talk about as well. But you just want to be confident and calm and not in a state of anxiety. Now, one more thing I want to say about this sign. It is totally okay if you wobble sometimes. And it's okay if you aren't always landed, landed, landed in the state of feeling like it's done, they're here, done deal. You can fall out of that sometimes. I tend to tell people and clients and in my courses, like ideally 80% of the time you're in the state of knowing it is done, knowing you're going to be with this person. I say 80% of the time is like a night, you know, that, that seems right. But um, it's okay. You don't have to be there 100% of the time. You just have to predominantly be there. So I have a video on how your predominant feelings are what manifests, and I will link it up there for you to watch after if you want. So that was the first sign. The first sign is you don't feel any lack. The second sign is you have 
an inner assumption. We can also call it an inner knowing, an inner assumption or expectation or knowing that your specific person wants you. That your specific person wants to be with you, that they're thinking about you, that they love you, that they care about you, that they can't stop thinking about you. I'll link a video on how to manifest your specific person to think about you and miss you if you want to watch that after. So when you are consistently living with a state of being that knows they want you, assumes they want you, this is a wonderful sign that it's going to manifest soon. And the reason is everything from in here manifests out there. So if you're landed in an inner knowing, yeah, of course they want to be with me. Now, sometimes we have to work our way up into this belief. Sometimes we can't start there. Sometimes we're not there. And my advice, like how I teach manifesting and what I teach my clients and in my courses, I really suggest that you start with affirmations that you actually believe. Because when we're saying affirmations that we believe, we don't feel any resistance to them. And so if you need to, maybe you can't think that, um, you know, or believe that your specific person wants you in this moment, maybe you're not there yet, but maybe you can believe that they care about you a lot or that you're really special to them. Maybe there's a, you back up a little bit and find the belief. What can you believe about your specific person that's going to lead you more and more closer and closer to knowing that they want to be with you or feeling they want to be with you. So this is the second sign. When you have an assumption that your specific person wants you or is thinking about you or cares about you or still wants to be with you, when you have these types of assumptions, then yes, it's going to manifest. So my courses on um, how to manifest a specific person, basically all of them are going to help you mold and shape your inner world to get into a state of assuming that they want you. That's how we manifest them. So the third sign that your specific person is close is you know it is done. The other ways we can say this is you know you're going to be together. You know you and your specific person are going to be in a relationship. You just know it's going to happen. You're in that knowing of it is done. We are going to be together. Now, people often get confused about this. I get, I, I've um, talked about this in like lots of videos, but people still ask me and get, get confused. From my personal opinion, you can still feel like you are going to be together, like it's going to happen. That is still okay to manifest your desire. The reason is, through my perspective, is feeling like you're going to be together drops you in the state of it is done. If you're certain you're going to be together, you know it's going to happen. It's like if you're certain you're going to Hawaii on vacation, it hasn't happened yet, but you know it's going to happen. You're landed in, it is done. This is happening. So it's the same thing. Okay. So these are three signs that you can look out for. They are, of course, all inner signs. You know, there are some outer signs and I do talk about those in the video I linked earlier, my other signs video. So you can watch that after. Thank you guys for being here with me. I love being here with you and I'll see you soon.